Hi there, McFadder Technical High School students and parents. This is Jeanette Johnson, your director and principal. Now that we're in the second half of the summer and the school district has begun to finalize decisions around the start of the 2020-2021 school year, I wanted to send out this video update to you to give you some important information on where we stand right now. If you've been watching the news, you may know that last week the school board determined that because of current conditions in our community, the school year will begin on August 19th for all students in an online only environment. Now, there's a school board workshop being held tomorrow, Wednesday, July 22nd. If you'd like to watch it, you can watch it live online at the school district's website. In that board workshop, the board will make some additional decisions about schedules and instructional delivery that will affect our students and teachers and will determine exactly what that online instruction will look like when we begin the school year. If you have a chance to watch that meeting, I encourage you to do so. But if you don't get a chance to watch it, don't worry. Once the decisions are made at that workshop and, it, and there's information to share with you about what online instruction will look for, like for all of us on August 19th, we'll be sending that out information out to our McFadder community directly as well. I also wanted to let you know that the parent registration questionnaire is still available online and will be available online indefinitely. That's the questionnaire where you indicated whether your preference for your son or daughter is to attend school in a fully online environment, in a fully face-to-face -face environment, or in a hybrid format. Now, obviously, because school will begin on August 19th in online instruction for all, your answer to that question won't affect what school looks like for your son or daughter on August 19th. However, once the school board determines that conditions are safe enough to begin returning students to school campuses, that's when your, your answer to that registration questionnaire will be used to help schedule your son or daughter. So it's important that you have that questionnaire answered and that you keep it updated as your decisions change about what you'd like for your son or daughter. So that questionnaire remains open indefinitely and it can be updated as often as you wish as you change your mind about this, the preference that you have for your son or daughter. If you don't remember how to access that questionnaire, you can find it at your child's single sign on launch pad, which is located at sso.browardschools.com. For our returning students who've been waiting on word about the 2020 school yearbooks, I need to let you know that unfortunately we still don't have a delivery date from the publisher. We're very sorry about that. We're sure you're frustrated. We're frustrated as well. If you recall, I told you back in the spring that the publisher, like everyone, had to shut down due to COVID related issues and has had to gear back up on a, on a new production schedule. As soon as we know anything more about when those yearbooks will be delivered, we will of course let all of you know. I'd also like to let all of you know that the week before school starts, we'll be issuing to students the materials and equipment that they need for their classes in the fall. So for example, this will be an opportunity for students to pick up textbooks for their fall classes, any necessary materials that we distribute to students for their fall classes. Those of you who don't already have laptops will be able to pick those up. And of course, students who've not yet had the opportunity to return textbooks or library books from last year will be able to do that as well. Again, that will be held the week before school starts. It will be a schedule by grade level so that we can manage it safely and efficiently for all of you. And we'll be sending out that schedule in about two weeks. We also wanted to let you know that all of the students fall schedules have been completed and have been put into the computer system. The district hasn't yet released those so that you're able to view them, but we do expect that to happen within the next couple of weeks and we'll let you know as soon as it's possible for you to view your fall schedule online. We'd like all of our students, both new and returning, and all of our parents to please mark Monday, August 17th. That's the date when we'll be holding two very important events, new student orientation, and parent back to school night, what some schools call parent open house. This year, we're holding those two events on the same day, Monday, August 17th, two days before school begins for students on August 19th. Both events will be virtual and both events will be held in the evening. 
We'll be sending out the specific start time for each event within the next two weeks. But for now, please mark your calendars. This will be an opportunity for all students and parents to get to know their fall term teachers and for our new students to get all the questions about McFadder answered that they might want to ask us. As we move closer to the start of the school year, we'll continue to communicate with you through every means we have as decisions are made that impact what school looks like for all of us on as of August 19th. So it's very important parents that we have the proper contact information for you. Please make sure you've got your updated home address, email address, and phone number so that we, when we send out mailers, emails, or parent link calls, they're able to reach you. Additionally, I'll be recording these videos on a periodic basis as we have updates, so continue to watch this space, follow our website, and if you're not already following us on social media, please do. Every time we have information to share, we'll push it out to you through all those means, so make sure that you help us keep you informed. In the meantime, until it's time to, to contact you again, I hope you're all having a fabulous summer and enjoying the time off. If you have questions for, for me, feel free to email me at any time. As you can see, I'm working all summer. The best way to reach me is to email me at Jeanette.Johnson at BrowardSchools.com. That's J-E-A-N-E-T-T-E dot J-O-H-N-S-O-N -E at BrowardSchools.com. I look forward to hearing from you, and I'm excited for the start of the 2020-2021 school year. Have a great day.